Hey, what's up, everybody? My name is Trophy, not the babbling Belgian, and welcome back to God of War. We're, uh, well, pretty high up in the mountain, but we suddenly got attacked by a, what appears to be a thunder dragon, a lightning dragon, and uh, he kind of smashed our elevator oh. to smithereens. But uh, it looks like we finally have a way of uh, that? crushing that red stuff. So um, it appears that that red stuff is uh, weak to thunder damage. Or lightning damage so I'm assuming this is kind of a tutorial of how to deal with that you can destroy world tree sap obstacles by combining shatter crystals with electric energy okay so most of them do have one of those crystals inside and uh, there we go close up easy as that so I'm gonna assume we're gonna get an electric attack later on that allows us to open up those passages we've been seeing um, okay. I can't believe we fought a dragon. I was aiming for his eyes, but I kept losing my footing. Do you think this is their home? Did they move in after the giants left? Or are they why the giants left? Boy, the air grows thin here. No more questions. Well, I feel Breathe. like he kind of has a point. Oh, yes. He, 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 he does have a point. That, did the dragons move in after the giants were killed? Or the other way around? That they killed the giants and on whose behalf. Because in the previous episode we talked about um, that the golds might be living up on this mountain right now. Which is why the giants... Do what? Sindri? Okay. Sindri! Did you hear that? Sounds like someone's screaming. Oh, well, definitely they have to uh, save that fellow. I'm hoping he can't die because otherwise I missed the side quest already. Wait, Holy yeah. mother... Can you kill something that big? Uh, yeah. If we can catch him off balance. I can distract him. You're just taking a little kid into a dragging fight. Jesus. We have to help him. Look how big that Break thing right. is. Find an angle. Wait for my mark. And how blind it is because it's not looking at us. Oh god. Hey, Oakley! Over here! Okay. So I'm gonna have to try and get around it. Can I jump on top of it? Oh god. This is a bad idea. Oh, fuck all. That didn't do anything. Uh, we had the advantage, but now... Oh, what the hell? What the hell is going on? Inside of the dragon's mouth. Um, okay, so I'm hitting its tongue or its uh, upper mouth. Oh yeah, this is an arena all right. Sake. That's an electric attack. Oh wow, what the? Oh, it came down again. Okay. Ah, oh, wait. I might have a point. that did something? Okay, wait until he's electrified this trailer. I did, because he was... He, he did explode. There we go. And uh, one, two, three... And maybe this last. I think I powered through that attack just because of the... Oh, what the hell? Oh, okay. 
Probably should block that. There we go. And then one, two, maybe the swipe. Yeah, that took quite a bit off. I think the game is giving out too many hints now, but... So now it's gonna... Jesus Christ! So he puts down his paw in that stream over there. Damn it. Yeah, that, that's gonna kill me. Yeah. Okay. Reset. Can't forget, I can actually use the arrow. I'm already past the first phase now. I can actually use arrows, right? No, no, okay, it's, it's right there, but I can't apparently use it. Fair enough. Just trying things out. So now I need to use the crystals again. Okay, 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 okay. fair enough. Oh wait, where's my crystal? Where's my crystal? I think the crystal. It is gone now. Boom! Let's just uh leave that over there. One, two, three! There we go. Max, 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 Max. Jesus. Smack, 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 smack. Okay, where the hell is this ball going? Okay, this is a waste. There we go, crystal. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Come on, big dragon. There we go. Smack, 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 smack. Okay, cinematic, that means next phase probably. No, 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 no! Jesus! Are you okay? Yeah! I have a plan. Be you ready do? to lower the crane on Ooh. my rock. I don't know how this thing works. I do not care. Be ready. Jesus! Give me two seconds, please. There we go. Come on, come on, come on. Smack, 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 smack. That didn't do anything, so I'm guessing he's uh, gonna do something now. Damn it. There we go. Did he get health back? What the hell? Oh, wait. Okay, now, apparently. Hook coming down. Ooh, in the head. Okay, 
Oh, you're pulling him towards the crystal. Ooh. I'm just pressing circle again. Is it dead? Because the crystal exploded. Oh, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> okay. That was badass. Holy crap. Wow. We actually did it. Where did that dragon come from? Uh, but, but, but nobody's killed a dragon for hundreds of years. Well, it's dead now. And unless I'm mistaken, you did all that for me. Yes, you are mistaken. kind of. The dragon was simply in our path, nothing more. You deny it all you want, but you saved me, and that deserves compensation. Okay, we like to hear that. What are these? Braided mistletoe arrows, straighter than Heimdall and perfectly weighted. Oh. Uh, Five of them. Thanks? Oh. Okay. Hold on. Uh, ooh, not that. Um. How big is that again? sack? Yeah. He said you lost your talent. <laughs> oh, and that I'm selfish. No, I'm sure. That I value a weapon's look. No, over its purpose. That I'm pretentious. No, and I'm tight. Fussy. I know what he thinks, but he can't hurt me any. Ah! Where does the fish come from? Burn that. Burn that, yeah. <laughs> I do not have time for this. No, 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 no. Wait, 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 wait. I have a better idea. What? Electric deck. From that dragon. Electric deck. Yes, 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 yes. Let's just pluck one off there, because we're going to get an electric attack. Okay. Can I do that? Okay. Let's pull that one out. Dragon Slayer. Chop. And chop again. This is like the tree from the beginning. Watch it looks kind of the... weird oh, now. Oh, never mind. So unclean. So unclean, yeah, so, kind of. So, so that's an electric oh, dragon no. tooth. 2,000 experience points. That's dragon tier, dragon tooth. Oh. Okay. Hi, Sindri. Let's give that to you immediately. The yeah. objects of your repulsion. I'm not touching that. Just hold it out. <laughs> now, run that along the string of your son's bow. Ooh, electric arrows. Just humor me. Atreus, your bow. Your bow, who lo that which looks awesome, by the way, by now. Two passes should do it. Uh, now. Look at that. You have acquired shock arrow. Shoot them at shatter crystals to destroy nearby world tree sap obstacles. There we go. Whoa. Oh, sure. Now you're impressed. Okay. Bloop. Um. See, you figured it out on your own then. Just never mind. Oh, we I did get a tutorial message. Beautiful and complex artistry of my craft or anything. No, just anything to help you. Yep. And I can switch arrow types, which is cool. Okay. Just gonna quickly check if he has any more upgrades for me. Let's do so it. I'm gonna buy the metal plated shoulder guard now as well. Who's tight? Who knew? Equip it, and then we're gonna upgrade it as well to get the enchantment socket back. Yeah. Amazing. There we go. Okay, let's talk to Sindri because he apparently has something on his mind. Where'd you learn how to do that, Sindri? Well, after Brock and I parted ways, I undertook some study in Vanaheim, truly mind-expanding. Now and then, I need new inspiration to grow creatively. Part of why we split up, my brother and I, he's stuck in his way, so our work stagnated. Sure, we mastered weapon making, but then what? Change is a part of life. If you can't adapt, learn to thrive, you'll be left in the dust. And that's filthy. Okay. Until next time. Okay. A bit harsh, harsh toward your brother who was just trying to preserve his craft. Before you go, see that you take special care of the peak. I'm pretty sure Odin is protecting something up there. And you there don't we go. Get on the Aesir's bad side. Who? Us? Odin is protecting something up there. Well, yeah, that would explain the giant dragon, probably. 
Can we go... Oh, this is so... Can't we? Oh, that would have been cool. Because, yeah, at, at the end of the Hydra fight, at the beginning of God of War 1, you actually need to go down the throat of the Hydra you just killed and uh, pull out the, the, the sea captain to just get the key from, uh, from his neck. Which you do, and then kick the captain down the throat of the Hydra anyway. Have you made it out of Fafnir's storeroom yet? Yeah, original uh, Kratos wasn't such a nice guy. But yeah, let's keep going. We haven't been to the like storeroom yet, Sindri, but here. we'll do that later on. Now we fought dark elves, and trolls, and ogres, and a dragon. I feel like we could be anything now. We win because we are determined, disciplined, not because we feel ourselves superior. Sure, I know. It's just, it feels good to be strong, you know? Yes. It sure I know. does. Yeah. Definitely knows that. This Kratos has gained and lost power quite a few times already. Which, uh, I think not all of it was uh, so pure of heart. Which I think is why he sounded so regretful. Tears Revenge, light runic attack, a powerful spinning attack against a single target with a follow-up attack that slams the enemy to the ground. Just a bunch of damage. Uh, blam, okay. You lose a lot of time with that. And I think the, the horizontal swipe is still better than uh, what I have, than what I, what I just got there. Because the Tempest was the vertical attack, I think. Oh no, that's just that. That's also good, mind you. So either the horizontal sweep or the spinning attack. I'm just going to keep the sweep. I like the sweep. So just upgrading the stun potency of the light arrows and then the shock duration of the other arrows. So more shock damage. Shock duration. And then what else do we have? Greater amount of shock damage or can be chained to multiple enemies. That is actually really cool. Or I'm just gonna upgrade the arrow damage and melee damage as a base. And then a haymaker to uh, the fury drive to add to the rage combat. There we go. Not quite a bit of uh, abilities right now which are gonna come in handy I suppose. But next up we need to climb up here I suppose. A bit of a ladder. I don't know how far we are from the top of the mountain now, actually. Because I feel like we should be almost there. I mean, we took the claw. We just had to climb first. Then we took the claw. Then we had the elevator ride. And then we had the frick flipping dragon. Okay. Oh. I did block that. Okay. Let's just add a bit of uh, stun damage because he's regenerating immensely there. So if I stun him completely, the nightmare goes out of him. There we go. Now I can kill this guy more easily, I think. There we go. He had an arrow in the face. So yeah, so we need to stun that guy to get the uh, nightmare out of his ass. What's that? Whoop! A chest. Just saw that glimmering in the distance. Ooh, and quite a bit of hack silver actually. Okay, what's this? Oh, it's going... No, that's where we came from. That's where we came from, never mind. We just started the fight immediately. Kind of disorients me sometimes. Uh, so if you go over here, you can actually fire at that. Oh, I'm gonna like this. Should and there's I another one. Found it and it blow up. No, it didn't. That crystal, I shot it once, but it's going again. Yeah, it keeps going. Bottoms up, another cup, and those are actually worth a lot of uh, hack silver. I think it's 5,000 a pop. But let's just move that. Up there. And fire away. There we go. Let's kill them as quickly as possible. And there go the nightmares. Interesting. 
we're just alone this time. So I, I keep wondering why they they throw in those uh, little fights in between. And I feel like that would be... Well, maybe it's just to annoy us a bit. And there we go. So now we know how to get rid of the red stuff. Let's just kill the nightmare quickly. Bam! 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 Oh yeah, right, this guy doesn't care about my own. I just want to take out the projectile guy first. So if I just put the axe away... Okay, and there he went against the wall. Let's keep punching. And let's get his head off. There we go. Okay, I'm a really big fan of the combat in this game. It's just so nicely done. That's a rage, no. Experience. Although I could have used the health in this case. Might not have been the best decision. But uh, yeah, we'll deal with that when we come to it. And another bit of Hexel from the guy we killed before. Okay, so this doesn't seem to have a crystal in it. Ooh. So I'm first gonna kill... This guy, okay, he blocked it. Oh, wow, he just killed me in one hit. That's not entirely true, but almost. So, a praying fellow. So those guys are immune to my axe, which means I should just put that away. And just try and do this the normal way. There we go, finisher. Nice shot. Oh, he just exploded. Oh, yeah, can't block that. Could use Rage of the Golds against him, but... I feel like I got this. Oh wow. Just need to be careful. There we go. There we go. Taken care of. There's a bridge. Oh yeah. There indeed is a bridge. Probably has to do something with uh, the fact that we need to get back first. There is another CRN chest, the one they were uh, they were praying towards. Don't see the lattice just yet, so I'm just gonna grab a bit of sap, throw that at the tree. Nope. Uh, change arrow types. There we go. And it's gone. Ooh, it's another story time thingy. Another one here. There we go. This one's called Emir. Mother tried to tell me this one, but I think I was too young. Are giants coming out of his armpits? Hmm. I think that might be Odin stabbing him. So, yeah, the source of the giants was killed by Odin then. Let's check that out. Okay, never mind. What's that? I kind of missed the story. Ah, there we go. There's the story one. This one's confusing. Ymir's the first giant and things spring from his body. Not just other giants, but wind, trees, sun, maggots that turn into dwarves maybe? Then Odin kills him, but where did he come from? Yeah, there's indeed the four elements are sprouting from his body as well. And yeah, a lot of crazy creatures. And then Odin kills him. Hmm. Interesting. Okay. That's another bit of lore, and now we could probably take this stuff, and if I throw it over there, does that actually count? Sure it does. I will never get tired of shattering things with this. Yeah, 
I wouldn't too, so let's grab another one. Throw that at the bridge. Uh, nope, throw and then fire. There we go. Dropping down the bridge. And I think I'm gonna grab one with me. I feel like I'm gonna need one more. So first I'm gonna... Jesus. Dead. 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 Let's just kill all those. Ah, I'm back in the face. And I just killed him outright. God damn it. I kind of auto aim towards the, the nightmare there, but uh, there we go. Is that the one I, I threw before? I can pick that back up. Ooh, great. Great. Saves me a bit of time. Boom. Boy, over here. Oh, Sir. boy. I'm waiting. There goes the text. And then, uh, new lore marker found. Here fell Nurtus of the Vanir, slain by Magni and Modi, sons of Thor. The Jutnar bear witness to the cruelty of this long war. Neither Aesir nor Vanir may triumph. It is foreseen, but what may be left of Midgard before they lay down arms? The giants want a peace, no wonder they like tears so much. So yeah, again, the struggle against those two factions of golds in uh, this place. Hmm. There is something up there as well, but how would we get back up? Because the bridge was in the wrong... Oh, wait. Probably this. And now it freeze. Let it go. We could probably move forward over here as well. So let's just head up first. And I could get a healing stone, thank you. And then open this up. Oh, Jesus Christ! Seriously? And he got stunned enough, I think. How the hell did he not... He was stunned completely, but... There we go. Couldn't really get the stun off on him, but uh, he was hoarding all the treasure. The bastard. Inscribed sign of perseverance. Let's take a look at that. Very low perk activation chance to grant a blessing when damage is taken. Nah, nah. What's this? Nah, I'm not gonna use that. That's silly. Oh. There's the... Oh, fuck. Okay. There's the R. But it's not gonna regenerate like that, which is good. So I just need to find them. There's the sea. Aha, and near the story time is the uh, end. There we go. Three seals destroyed, and now we can open up the chest to, I don't know, an apple or a meat horn. Assuming an apple, but... Three, two, one. Uh, an apple. First of three, probably, yeah, because it's been a while since we found one of those. But, let's continue on just a little bit further and see what else we can find. I'm feeling the tension rising. Not long now, Mom. Yeah, not just for Mom and her ashes, it's just... I feel like something big is about to happen. Aside from, well, you know, the dragon we just fought. Oh yeah, that definitely looks like Mount Olympus. Oh, the summit! We're so close now! Yeah. This is not gonna be that easy. Fought the dragon. It's all right. I can hold it. Stop. Yeah, we'll need to fix that, boy. Because you can't fire an arrow when you're constantly holding your quiver. A broken quiver will slow your draw. Pain we endure. Faulty weaponry we do not. This will do for now. Good. Huh. Nice idea. We are Good. high up and there's a lot of other mountains Go. as well. 
Steady okay, boy. This, this Mind looks your footing. amazing, by the way. And oh, look at the snow. It's similar to what Horizon Zero Dawn did. But I almost feel with the, the snow splashing upwards, it's a bit better than what uh, they did. There we go. Let's get the axe back. And uh, continue on our way. But this isn't going to be this easy, is it? Yeah, yeah, there we go. How do you like this? Atreus is looking hell up out there. Let's get him off the mountain. He's... Is he carrying a shield? Okay then. Swipe! Where's the other one? Did he fall off? I think he fell off. I'm mad, boys. I'm really, really mad. Slamming my way through everything. Smack! Yes, you were, boy. Yes, you were. I think I hit you kind of there. That was a long one. It wasn't really. They were pretty weak. Oh, no. That's the only stuff I can't break yet. Hidden man, distant voice. Okay, I'm just going to check the sides here. Because I feel like we're going to find a few things here. Yep, another cup. That's another 5,000 hex silver right there. And then a chest I can't open, so... Let's head up towards the hidden man. Yes, be silent. That sounds like the same man who came to our house. You said you killed him. I see you brought company this time. Mimir. Important if the sons of Thor deem to grace me with their presence. Tell me, you two still tripping over yourselves to impress Daddy? The tattooed man. Tracks show he now travels with a child. Where would they go next? Why would I know that? You the smartest man alive, aren't you? Smarter than all the dead ones, too. You help me, I help you. Tell me where they are, and I'll talk to Odin. Your father won't let me go, Baldur, and he won't let you kill me. You have nothing to offer me, so take your questions. Take your threats, take these two worthless wankers, and piss off! When no one's looking, we'll be back for your other eye. Don't you forget, we are We really are, aren't we? Oh, shut up, you idiot. That was interesting. Bestiary update. It's, it's uh, a, a bit weird. They weren't really beasts, but hey, I'm guessing the best area was, ju was just updated. Let's head up. I'm not familiar with the name Mimir, but it must be important. I can't believe two sons of ah, gods didn't hear us climbing around. A tattooed man traveling oh, a child. he's a tree. Boy, took their path. Make sure we're alone. But we just saw them leave. Do as I say. That's a uh, you are. peculiar fellow. And I would keep it that way. Who are you? Me? I'm the greatest ambassador to the gods, the giants, and all the creatures of the Nine Realms. A Scottish. I every corner of these lands, every language spoken, every war waged, every deal struck. They call me Mimir, smartest man alive. And I have the answer to your every question. Why does the son of Odin hunt us? Okay, there are a few gaps in my knowledge. <laughs> okay, that was awesome. Prison here for 109 winters. I'm a clever lad. I can piece it together. I promise. Just given time. Nobody there. Just like I said. What would have? mother is dead. What would you have done if she they she were us there? To spread her ashes on the highest peak in all the realms. Oh, then you've come to the wrong place, little brother. The highest peak in all the realms is not here in Midgard. 
It's in Jotunheim, realm of the giants. No! You could just do it here, you know. Take a look. What the hell? His face is a projector. This is the last known bridge to Jotunheim and all the realms. Oh yeah, because your time was locked Looks off. Looks like a giant's finger scrape in the sky. That's the highest peak in all the realms. No here. Can we just take that bridge? We have a Bifrost. When the giants destroyed all other bridges to their realm, they locked this one up with a secret rune. If it still exists, only a giant would know it. And all of them left Midgard a long time ago. True. But today, the winds of fate have kicked up a strange vortex of coincidence. Fact is... There's only one person alive who can get you where you need to go. And luckily for you, my schedule's wide open. Okay. That's uh, an interesting We're development. Jotunheim, right? It's your best and only move from a tactical standpoint. It's the one place the man who cannot be killed won't follow you. Balder. So now what he's called the man who can be yes! killed. First, you need to cut off my head. Wait, what? Wait, what? <laughs> yeah. Odin made sure that no weapon, not even Thor's hammer, could free my body through these bonds. But fortunately, you don't need my body. The trick is, we need to find someone who can reanimate my head using the old I love magic. Atreus <laughs> trying anyway. There's a witch of the woods. She knows the old ways. And oh, and you help? can see she the red trees down there. Try. But if she fails, he will be dead. He tortures me, you know. Every day, brother. Odin himself sees to it personally, and believe me, there is no end to his creativity. Every single day. This... This isn't living. Wait a second. Very his well. face... Oh, I can't watch this. No, no, wait, wait, wait. He said brother. Brother. Again. In case you can't resurrect me, there's something you need to know. Boy, the longer you wait to tell him his true nature, the more damage you do. He will resent you, and you may lose him forever. They have the same There's face. That is Kratos' brother. Uh, so you value your privacy more than your son. I'm going to cut off your head now. Yeah, yeah. indeed. Okay. It is him, isn't it? Oh, I can't I can't remember his name. Cuz he's calling himself Mimir, Yuna. but We're going to Yuna. That is We're going to find the long It's the same the face as Kratos. That's, that's, so it must be cuz Kratos has a twin brother. Yeah. It was revealed in the the PSP games. Um but I can't for the life of me remember his name right now. Um so that would explain why it looks like that. 109 years stuck in the tree. Does that mean that Kratos is here for 109 years old as well? That would be... Because he kept calling him brother. That was what, what, what set me off. Um, there's a shiny shiny chest over there. But yeah, let's, let's leave that conversation topic for, for later on. Maybe we'll uh, find out something more about that. Because his brother is never talked about in the uh, the original trilogy. Aha, another cipher. So that's three out of four, which is interesting. Um, but I think with that revelation, that uh, plot twist that we're not yet at our destination, we're going to take a little break. So uh, can I can actually stand here. Yes, we can. So thank you guys enormously for watching. Uh, if you liked the episode, don't forget to like it right here on YouTube. And uh, when we get back, we're going to try and find this rune that the Mimir guy in the tree was talking about. I'm carrying his head around with me. So uh, thank you guys enormously for watching, and I hope to see you next time on God of War. Goodbye.